I'm Carly Bond, and you're watching SVTV. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform, finding character, and giving others a voice. This is SVTV. Lexi asked some teachers their rankings on popular restaurants. Let's go see what they said. ...that you just can't stand to begin with. Oh, man, let's see. Hey, I like Subway. Yeah. I, I think Subway and, and I... We went to the new Burger King up north here, and after, I hadn't been a Burger King for probably 25 years, and they got my first order wrong, and so they let me keep the wrong order, and so I really got two different orders, and it was all terrible. So we, my wife and I and both children agreed. Um, Wendy's, I, you know, have you had the new Baconator breakfast sandwich? No. Oh. Oh, but, but yeah. my son, my son go. We go to Wendy's. That's my oldest son's favorite place. So we go to Wendy's like uh, more than I care to admit. Probably we always get the same thing. We get the four for four with the crispy chicken sandwich and chicken nuggets. And I mean, he even knows what I mean, he can probably order it himself at this point. Subway, my my wife likes Subway a lot. It's not my favorite sandwich place, and so that's probably why I would maybe put that more towards kind of the bottom. But when it okay. comes to Sonic, they're, uh, I probably have a Sonic drink once every day. So when it comes to the drinks, like, bought on, you no, know, like, getting there before 11 o'clock, happy hour. But for the, their food, I very rarely ever actually eat Sonic food. I just go there for the drinks. Well, I'll tell you, did you ever try the s'more shake? I did you know, not. And that was fantastic. And now the uh, trick or treat shake, and yeah, that's pretty darn good too. There was more candy in that than I gave out at Halloween. I mean, that, was, that was thing was loaded. All right, all right, Lexi. I think we're ready to go. All right, number ten, Taco Bell. Number nine, McDonald's. Number eight, Chick Fil A. Number seven, Arby's. Number six, Five Guys. Number five, Burger King. Number four, Wendy's. Number three, Sonic. Number two, runner up in case number one can't make it, Spangles. And the number one place we like to eat, Subway. All right, so at number 10 on the Stevie Hebert uh, fast food list, Burger King. Burger King. Number nine on the list, Spangles. Number eight, Wendy's. Number seven, McDonald's. Number six, Subway. Eat fresh. <laughs> Number five, Arby's. Number four, Sonic. Number three, The Bell. Number two, Chick-fil-A. And on top of the list, for you burger fanatics out there, Five Guys is the way to go. The SHS Theater presents It's a Wonderful Life radio play. Watch in person this Thursday, Friday, and Saturday in the SHS Auditorium or watch live online. Doors open at 6.30. The play begins at 7. Tickets are $5. If you have not paid for your Washburn classes or enrolled in a payment plan, this needs to be done by the end of the semester. Check your school email for payment information. Due to, due to the ineffective protection of certain masks, SHS no longer allows the use of gaiters, bandanas, or vented masks. The parent-teacher conferences are this Wednesday from 1 to 8.15 and next Wednesday from 7 to 3.15. Winter sports begin Monday, November 16th. Make sure you have your physical turned in. Today at 1.15, Cole SQ will sign a letter of intent to play baseball at Cloud County Community College. Congratulations, Cole. Now on to weather with Zoe.
Good afternoon, Vikings. We have been experiencing quite a bit of clouds in the area, but the sun is finally on the horizon. Today we are seeing the rain move out of the area, but our cold temperatures are going to be staying. For Veterans Day, we are expecting a very chilly day with our highs only being up in the 50s. For your SVTV seven day forecast, we do have a slight chance of rain this weekend, but on the upside for this weekend, we are expecting our temperatures to start to feel more like fall and be up in the 60s. Now back to your anchors. That's all for today, Vikes. Have a great day.